All right, hey guys, it's Jack here from Peach Guitars. We're continuing our Sir theme. So if you've already seen, we did a bit of an in-depth focus on the Pro ranges. So we've got the Standard Pro, the Modern Pro, and then lastly we did the Alt-T Pro. This is a little bit different, and I did touch on this in one of those videos where we said we wanted to uh, focus a little bit more in-depth on the custom line. So basically, we're currently in possibly the best uh, period of Sir's history in terms of the fact that they've got such an incredibly versatile standard range of instruments and amplifiers and pedals as well. But uh, it's easy to forget that the, the thing they were perhaps best known for, at least back in the day, was that they were essentially just one big custom shop. And it's clear to see with the guitars that I've pulled out here, uh, just from what we've got in stock, that that is still very much true to this day. They're still working as a fantastic custom shop, and basically, if you can dream up a guitar, uh, they will happily build it for you. One of the most difficult things with that is there's typically a fair bit of build time that you have to wait for those guitars to be built if you want something custom made. The nice thing is, that we have such a good relationship with Sir, over time we've managed to amass a lot of these custom instruments that we've spec'd ourselves. So if you don't want to wait, the best time to get one is probably now. If you hit peachguitars.com, you'll be able to see the full inventory of custom guitars that we have. Okay, so I wanted to pull out four examples from the shop that really show off the full breadth of options that you get from Sir's custom shop. Uh, starting with this fantastic guitar, so this is obviously one of their uh, custom T models. And this is quite a standout piece, so let me just talk you through the wood configuration really quickly because it's quite extravagant and it pretty much pretty much sums up how many different options you can get from their custom shop. So this is a walnut figured top on this guitar and then the neck and the bodywood are made up of black limber which is something I've never heard of or seen on another guitar before. Really really cool wood combination as well as an ebony fingerboard on this guitar. So basically all of these custom guitars not only look fantastic but they all sound completely unique because they're not following any particular formula that their pro or standard series of guitars also follow. So basically you can spec up exactly what you want regardless of how kind of extravagant it may be but chances are there may be something in our custom collection that we already have here in stock that may be fitting to what you're looking for. Or equally, it may just be something like this, in my particular case, I love this guitar, that you'd never have even considered before. So this is a really interesting wood combination, but it really serves its purpose well. Uh, so some basic other features about this guitar, you know, you've got like a Goto 510 trem, which previously on a classic T or any T style guitar from Sir, you wouldn't usually see. So again, it's the custom options really taking effect. Um, so obviously, if you wanted to build something like this, you could do. But as I said, there is a bit of a wait time, so chances are there may be something that we already have in stock that may already appeal to what you're looking for. Okay, so we've got another great example here of a guitar that's a little bit different. We tend to see a lot of moderns and buy up a lot of moderns from the Sir Custom line, but to get a standard is a little bit of a rarity. So the standards are fantastic guitars in their own right, obviously slightly different body style. Uh, this is a really great example, again, of just the Sir Custom Shop doing things a little bit differently that you wouldn't see on their standard line of guitars. So although this is an older body with a flame maple top, it is an incredible example of a flame maple top and they also extend that kind of level of finesse to the neck. So this is, a, uh, I believe, a triple A grade roasted maple neck on this guitar uh, with a matching headstock. Go to a 510 trem again, locking tuners. So pickup wise in this guitar, we've got a pair of V60LP single coil pickups with an SSH Plus in the bridge, which is a really nice versatile combination. And you've also got the added advantage of having their blower switch on here, which you'll hear me using the sound clip. So basically I have the neck pickup dialed in with the volume and the tone rolled back and then pressing that switch just basically allows me to route the bridge handbucket straight out to the output jack. So you're going to hear that in the playing example.
Okay, so here's a great example of a custom modern. This is obviously a two humbucker variant of this guitar, which again is not something you see typically in the pro lineup, so it's great to have options to have just two humbuckers if you want them. Uh, still just as versatile though with a five-way blade switch. This is a basswood body with a gorgeous quilted maple top. We've got a triple A uh, roasted maple uh, neck on this guitar with a Bolivian rosewood fingerboard and all the usual appointments like the 510 trim and the Sir Locking Tuners. This guitar sounds particularly brilliant, I think. So lastly, we've got what is probably the most visually striking guitar of all the customs that we've got in at the moment. This is obviously a modern with the HSH pickup configuration. Uh, this is a burl redwood top, a top a roasted swamp ash body with a mahogany neck and an ebony fingerboard. So again, all these components differ from any of the standard production model guitars you'll find from Sir. So again, this is just a great example of something that's completely off the charts and something completely different if that's what you're after. Uh, tonally, again, this is a completely unique guitar, I think. Sounds really, really nice. Uh, we've got the standard, rather standard pickup configuration though of an SSV, an SSH Plus in the bridge and a Sir ML pickup there too. And you do have the option to split both the pickups, uh, both the humbuckers with this push-pull on the tone control. <laughs> Okay, so just to round this off then, I hope this was a decent little introduction into the Sir Custom line. As you can tell, of course, this is incredibly expansive and could go on forever. Uh, like I said before, we're really fortunate to have quite a healthy stock of Sir Custom guitars at any one time. So if you want to find out even more about the inventory that we have, go to peachguitars.com and check out what we've got in stock at the moment. You'll be able to get current pricing information, see high resolution images of every guitar, and also see and hear how they sound in terms of the videos that we shoot for every guitar. So that's about it. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, as always, please leave us a like and comment down below with your thoughts. Let us know which of these four guitars was your favorite. Uh, and also, if you haven't done so already, please hit the subscribe button and tap the bell icon that's right next to it. That way you'll be notified of all the video uploads that we make in the future. So thanks so much for watching folks, I'll look forward to seeing you next time, take care.